Hey everybody, what is up and welcome back here to the latest episode of this Marek Divos My Play Karuma. We're into episode number 9 here and we are just arriving today on the 18th of August here to the manager's office. We're about to get underway with a quick conversation with him. He just wanted to have a little meeting and said it's nothing too serious, but he just found out about our Volta involvement, our uh, street football involvement. And he wanted to have a quick chat about it. He was a little bit concerned that it might be affecting our league performances. That's what this episode is going to be about, guys. And he doesn't want... He's not saying it is perfect, um, affecting them, but he doesn't want us to get injured or to um, kind of take Volta over as our career. So he pretty much just basically asked me what what my thoughts were on it and whether it's going to be okay. Guys, that's going to be the poll for this episode. The manager is asking, do we want to continue with Volta and do we want to keep playing with the J10 crew? Do we want to keep playing just casually with the GMS team? Do we want to quit Volta altogether? Just, I'm just asking you guys right now off the top of this episode so we can see how we want to progress with this career mode because I don't want to be putting Volta in if you guys don't want it, but I'm really enjoying it and I hope you guys are too. It's quite good to do as a side thing. But guys, here we are the next day going for a run and um, we got the notes from the last episode where the, the guys scored the game. Uh, they, I think they won 2-0 they scored in the game and that was the guy that sealed the deal with his goal unfortunately for us guys so hopefully we can get back into scoring form in this episode with the game we've got coming up as you can see we've dropped down um, we've played 5 got 5 points this season we're in 16th position in the league at the moment which is kind of bad compared to how I thought we were going to go at the start of the season. We won two games in a row, I believe, or something. And then it just kind of went downhill from there. And um, so hopefully we can turn that around, guys, in this game today. Uh, on this episode, sorry, on the end of this week on Saturday, we've got um, Mag Deberg coming up on the 24th of August as we finish off this month, guys. And then we're going to be heading into September, October, November, December. So many months, guys. Every um, week is an uh, episode, remember. So we're just going to be cruising through with daily videos for you guys. As you can see, we're just running through the neighborhood here, getting our fitness up and as you can see it went up to 98 there. there's not much higher we can get with fitness now but we have got in this game uh, in this day right now sorry we've got a thing at the J10 warehouse we've got a little training session guys because they have organized a little tournament for us to take part in as now we are part of the J10 crew so they kind of want to train us up a little bit and uh, the guy called Big D is going to be training us up a little bit just with some defending drills he wants us to get a bit better at defending just kind of understand the game so as you can see we're just doing a little drill here but we're going to be defending the goal trying to block all the shots at the moment it's a little bit hard Big D just taking the shots here and we're just trying to get a few blocks in guys we're just preparing ourselves for our Volta tournament which is coming up which is going to be lots of fun and um, if it goes well the GMS team might be traveling to Berlin which isn't too far away for a local tournament that's happening in a few weeks and um, also got the J10 local tournament which they're hosting at their home here guys so that's something else we're training for as part of the story mode for Volta as you can see we ended up getting a B I think here and um, getting a good, oh A sorry there getting a good couple of blocks in and that is it for that day guys we had a nice bit of training with Volta and now we are here with the Instagram post the latest one guys sorry these Instagram posts aren't getting up enough uh, quick enough for you guys to comment on so I will be trying to get those up well in advance so I can put them in with all your comments so this one hasn't got too many comments on it which is my fault I only put it up a few hours ago but I have got a couple this is the comments saying um oh this is the post saying loving my free kick practice and i got one of you there little kevin hart saying keep it up bro and um you'll be a pro uh, as good as beckham and messi which are really cool because they're really good free kick takers as well as one there from the second guy raber great to go ahead one day you will win the golden boot i do not doubt which is awesome hopefully we can being a center attacking midfielder we will be looking to get some assists and some gold especially our free kicks guys i think we're going to put the next episodes pop up for the choice of training for the for the next month as we're finishing off this month after this episode so it's going to be up to you guys and after the next episode what you want to see us training and um depending on what you guys choose is what we're going to be focusing on over the next month so it's going to be pretty fun to keep things going and getting you guys involved in this as you can see we've just arrived here at the next training session we're all the way into thursday already the game is right at the end of this episode so if you feel like it you can skip ahead to the game and watch that if you want if you enjoy watching these storylines then that is great stay here guys because i'm enjoying making these storylines we're here just arriving at training once again and uh we're keeping this as real as possible as you guys know this is a realistic my player career mode so yes it will be slow it will be slow to get through the weeks but it's going to be lots of fun and uh, we're going to really get to know Merrick and progress him through the league as you can see he's got an A in this uh, direct free kick adept training 69 at the moment overall very nearly 70 overall which I think we may be hitting it in this at the end of this episode or the next one it's so close to the top there we've got our good free kick accuracy and curve guys we're just not we're not able to score these training free kicks yet I don't know how many of you guys have seen I've done about I've done a good a good number of sessions like almost every episode I've done a training drill for free kicks 
kicks and it's just taking a lot of effort to actually get these in. I think it's just the power. Having the goalkeeper in there does make it tricky, but this is what we wanted. We want it to be hit difficult, so just like a real match scenario. As you can see, some of them there are being really accurate, but just not able to hit the back of the net at the moment. Some of them go in just, but they're not really good enough, and some of them just don't make it in. Like, look how close these are getting. The goalkeeper seems to be getting across to every single one at the moment. We just need to get more power into these, I think. And we're doing the curved uh, free kicks kind of like messy, which you guys is what you guys chose in the poll. So we're working on our free kicks kind of at this current stance, the basic stance that we started off with, with our shoulders and our slow approach but guys as you can see we're just just at the same time again we're just getting them either just wide or on target but not powerful enough so hopefully we can get enough power on these guys as we finish this off we're trying a few different styles of the curl and different kind of angles either hitting at the bottom or holding it on top of the ball as you can see we're trying some dippers there and they're getting on target they're getting a bit of power but they're just not getting in the back of the net at the moment which is really unfortunate and here we are finished with this day and now guys we're heading into friday the 23rd here where we're back at home and for this for this part of the episode and we're actually gonna be looking at something new we're gonna be looking at the volta shop guys if you guys want to see some more volta and you guys vote on that poll that we do want to see more volta then uh, we will be doing a lot of volta store stuff where we're gonna be looking at the store buying new clothes for us and the team we have to buy everything for the team separately as you can see here this is just a quick look a very quick look at the um, drops and the the store stuff guys we can purchase some new leggings there we can purchase some new shorts some new shirts if you guys want to see some of that and then leave your comments down below saying that you want to see certain types of clothing maybe a certain kind of kit like shorts or long pants and let me know what kind of style you want to see him playing Volta in and maybe the rest of the team as well maybe what color as well what, what kind of gear do we want that's basically going to be what this is guys so if you guys do want to see stuff like that leave your comments down below there's not going to be a poll for this one just i just want your general feedback on how you think it's all going to go guys we're here in episode number nine and we finally got to our game here at the end of this day guys seven minutes in and we're about to get this one underway we're away from home here against Maga de Bur, guys on the 24th of August it's raining now hopefully it won't be raining by the time we arrive at the away match but as you can see the 1860 Munich away bus here ready to go we are currently going to be playing uh, central left midfield as we always do in this next game with this defensive mid there playing a 4-1 4-1 formation Zieris up top we got Dressel there at center mid the two guys we've kind of been getting to know we've been getting to know them a bit at training too we're actually going to be adding some storylines in soon of those guys and their involvement and hopefully going to hang out with them a bit more because at the moment Merrick is definitely taking a bit of a, a solo streak in this career mode and we want to get some more people involved we want to get some more cool things going on for these storylines just hanging out with some people maybe partying with them maybe maybe just doing team bonding exercises there's going to be some cool stuff like that coming up but guys, as you can see right now, we're just here at the away game. It is raining here today, so it's carried on raining. We're actually the worst, the lowest scoring team in the league. We've only scored three goals this season, two of them being from Merrick and one of them being from Zieris up front. So we need to change that, guys. And if we can get a goal in this game, it will start adding us back into the goal scoring. So hopefully we can do that because if we can, we may just come away with a win here today in three points. We need it on the table as we are currently sitting bottom half of the table and we need it to get some points to boost us back up into the mid-table and maybe even head for some promotion places if we can get the run of form going. But guys, here we are three minutes into this game now coming forward with the first chance of the game. It's coming with Merrick running on the ball. He's sprinting past his defender here. He's made it past him. He's Carried on, the defender is gone in the smoke. He's gonna take the shot. Oh, and the goalkeeper saved it. Unfortunate for Marek there. Very good chance. Should have probably finished it. But the goalkeeper made a good save. And here we come now. Five minutes into this one now, guys. It's still very early days in this game. And we're coming forward with another chance here. Can we get this one in the back of the net? Six minutes. Here we come forward. Marek on the ball. What's the end? Cuts inside. Looks to take the shot. There it goes. It's in the back of the net. It is 1-0 in this game. Seven minutes played. And we go 1-0 up away from home. And Marek Divos there. The number seven. The goal scorer. Look at him. Hagging the camera, guys. We're back here in scoring form. Third goal in the three league a season and guys it's a great moment for Marek Divos running in from the midfield there cuts inside his man takes a great touch to get the ball back under control and finish it with, it with a finesse in the top right hand corner of the net guys eight minutes in third goal in the league this season for Marek Divos from the center midfield position which is really great to see and I get the feeling we're going to have a good game here today guys hopefully we can get more goals hopefully we can add to that as we go we're only 11 12 minutes into this game now and another chance is coming forward it's coming for them though we might just get this up the pitch if we can get it away no he's been tackled it's going to be a chance for the opposition can they equalize there no that was a terrible 
terrible shot from the player on the opposition team. Look at this. It balloons into the sky and rolls up his ankle. And it's gone out of play and out of the stands as well. <laughs> Guys, here we come with the next chance forward. Oh, great touch there from the player, but he's lost it. And it's coming here for Divos. He's laid it forward to his teammate now. We've got a good chance from Sierras. Can he lay this back? Yes, he has. A great three balls in Marek here. We've got a really good chance coming in the spaces. Can we square this or are we going to go solo? We're running near post. Square. Oh, how has he not scored? That was a key pass as well as you saw at the top, guys. How has he not scored that one? Unbelievable, Jeff. And here we come forward with the next chance now. It's going to be Marek Divos on the ball once again. Is he going to go solo this time? Yes, he is. The goalkeeper's made a good save. Marek didn't trust his teammates that time. 35 minutes in, guys. And we've got a throw in here on the right wing. Unfortunately, we haven't scored another goal. We really should have. Just gave it away here in the attacking third, guys. And we're actually going to try and check back and get the ball back now. The position coming forward with an attack just into the second half. A great touch to keep it in. And it's just laid it back there. And Marek's made a great interception, recovering and making up for his previous mistake. And here we come forward now. 50 minutes in and a chance is coming for 18-16 Munich after Marek's interception. Can we get this one forward here? Marek's taking a run down the right wing. It's gone to him to his feet here. He's got a good chance to lay it wide there it goes another three ball coming through the defense just doesn't know what they're doing today can we get this one inside the box to someone's feet he can it's a goal no again another squared across pass another excellent pass from Marek Divos and his teammates just cannot finish at the moment nobody seems to be able to score goals besides Marek in this team but here we come with another chance surely a goal Marek Divos on the ball takes a shot there and oh it's at the crossbar now Marek's missing as well that was such an unfortunate shot guys Hitting the underside of the crossbar, bouncing back out. 70 minutes into this game now. Look at that for a ball from Marek Divos. Doesn't quite make it to the player. I thought it was going to. And guys, here we are, guys, with 20 minutes remaining. 1-0 up at the moment. Are we going to be able to maintain this lead? We've had plenty enough chances. If we concede now, oh, jeez, the goalkeeper makes a good save. If we concede now, that will not be good for the squad, especially after all the chances that we have missed. <coughs> Excuse me, but the goal kick here would... <coughs> Ugh. 10 minutes remaining in this game and here we come forward trying to make our way down the pitch now with the squad guys and we're just trying to push this one forward laying it central here it's Divos on the ball can you get this one into space he's going to get this one wide is he going to cut back he's taking it back to the central midfield laid it forward here we've got a good chance chip through ball missed and it's chance for the opposition <coughs> he takes the shot sorry I'm trying not to cough as much as possible 88 minutes in that shot did not go in and guys, here come the opposition with an attack. Can we get this ball back here? It's going to be a good touch there. A great touch. A great tackle. And here we come forward with Divos on the ball. He's going to run past this man here again in this game. Just running past this man. Getting through on goal. Can we take this chance? We've got a chance to lay it square. He's going to go, he's going to go solo. Mary Divos. No. Another shot at the near post. Probably could have taken it a touch closer. We're into the 92nd minute now. Should have been 2-0. We should have had loads of goals in this game. We're definitely showing that we can attack. That is for sure. We just have not been able to finish in this game, unfortunately. <coughs> the corner now is going to be taken by Merrick. He's taken his time, that is for sure. We are about 20 seconds away from the final whistle, guys. Uh, as you can see, the number seven, Merrick Devo, stepping up for this corner. Can he put this one in? to a good position in the box and maybe scratch us another goal. A good header there. Great save from the goalkeeper, but it ends up going back to Marek and he was offside after taking that corner and it didn't count for anything. And guys, here we are about to finish this game now. We're into the 92nd minute. It's going to end any second. There it goes. The full time whistle, guys. This game has ended. We won 1-0 here, which is great. And uh, we've come away with all three points and thanks to Marek. We should have. Marek set up two or three open goals for our team. Did not score them. He also had another two shots himself, couldn't score them. The game should have probably been 3 or 4-0. Instead, it was 1. We came away with the points, but we should definitely have done better, guys. That is going to be it for this episode. We're going to finish off it right here in this game, and I'm going to see you guys all in the next episode. Don't forget to vote on the polls if you haven't already, and also make sure you give us a like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already, and join us in this series. It's going to be lots of fun, and we've got lots of cool things on their way. But for now, that's it from me, and I'll see you guys all in the next episode. Peace out.